morning, Christina. Good morning. How are you today? Cold and nervous. <laughs> You're nervous? Why? Uh, scared of the deep water. Okay, so right, right. Today we will try to see how comfortable you are swimming in the deep water and uh, you are telling me you are a bit uh, stressed about this experience, yeah. but you know how to swim. You're yeah. just not feeling good in deep, in deep hand. Yeah. Okay, so here is shallow. Let's maybe show me what you can do on the shallow first. The water is cold. <laughs> and uh, slowly we'll go in the deeper hands. Woo. Okay, you go when you feel comfortable, you go slowly. Okay. Okay, I try to relax. I have no idea what is your skill. Okay, 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 relax. Okay, how you feel? You okay? Can you swim longer than that or you're tired now? I can, I just see, I've seen the drop. Oh, the drop is right here. Yeah. Okay, so you, okay, maybe you show me on the on this where you feel comfortable. Just one whole lap, okay. but slowly, okay? okay? All right. Here we go. Okay, take your time. Okay. Okay. All right, no problem. Okay, just remember when you want to swim in the deep side, the water will be the same, okay? Basically, it's just the pressure you put in yourself that makes a big difference. But now when you swim, uh, you're, you're slightly too deep uh, on your body. You're not very horizontal. So you sink, basically, your legs are sinking too much, okay? okay? And you swim, it doesn't seem you're very comfortable or relaxed. So okay. it means you are spending a lot of energy okay. for a short distance. Um, and what you want is the opposite. You want to float more and you want to don't spend energy. You want to save your energy so you can swim one hour non-stop, for example. Uh, here, if you swim like this, I, I think within five minutes you have to stop. So try to go more slowly again. Okay. Remember to look deeper in the water so your body will float more okay. and slow down. Okay. Slow down, no, no pressure, okay? Ali, take your time. Okay, what what's wrong? No, I saw I saw the, <laughs> I saw the slope. Okay. So what I think for what is your freestyle at the moment? I don't have freestyle. I need no front crawl. I can do a bit of back crawl. Yeah yeah yeah. So, so what I'm calling freestyle is this front crawl you yeah. do now. Uh, I think it's um, it's not an effective front crawl. So there is also a way to swim. And we will not focus on the speed, we'll focus on your capacity to just be comfortable, yeah. okay? Right. Okay. So, uh, have you seen on the video how we do the, the sort of tiger or breaststroke? You know how to do breaststroke? Uh, no, I've tried it once before. But no. Okay, show me what is about the breaststroke. If you cannot do it, then I will teach you what is the tiger. Okay. Okay, Christina, okay, no problem. Look, take the camera. Just you can you can visualize on me. Okay. You, have a, you have a screen inside. So I want you to learn how to do instead of freestyle or breaststroke fast. Yeah. Just learn how to float underwater. You're basically going underwater, and you're gonna walk like this with your hands. Okay. <laughs> keeping your head on the surface first. So basically, we just we just try to. Keeping your head on the surface without touching the ground. You see, I'm going very slowly. Yeah. What's happening? For this to happen, I just paddle with my hands one by one. Okay? okay. My legs behind just slowly kick. It's not a fight. It's really like going super comfortable. You're gonna, yeah, yeah. Look slowly. Your hands. Okay. The paddling you are doing now has to be alternate. Left then right and left then right. So show me how you do it. Bigger. Left and right. Okay, your legs slowly more behind you, so you're gonna be light diagonal. Yeah, 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 yeah. Relax, relax. Look, stop, stop, stop. That's that's the way. So now relax more and go more slowly. What you want is to keep the traction. Okay, don't lose it. If you pull too fast, 
after you have nothing to pull anymore. So you keep pulling slowly left. When the left is gone, the right starts to pull. So you always have a pulling to move forward, okay? Okay, slowly, slowly. All right. Easy. Okay, now you breathe on the surface. Stay on the surface and kick with your legs. Try to finish just that distance, okay? Just my legs. Yeah, just until the wall. Okay. <laughs> That's my habit. Head always goes in the water. No. You can put your head in. You can put your head in the water. It's actually not. Okay, I see where we are. Right. I'll put the camera on my head so I can help you with my hands. Okay. Okay, there is two things, huh? Point one, you got to relax more because you're really stressed and that doesn't help you. It makes it makes things worse. Point two, wait. Point two, your hands alternate left and right one by one. Okay, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna carry your legs behind you for you to be flat. When you wanna breathe, just look up with your head. When you wanna blow your bubbles, exhale five seconds, okay? So, so I just I just hold you. What we do? We cross the lap, yeah. and you just walk with your hands like a tiger. Okay. Easy, easy. Blow your bubbles when you feel possible. Wonder. Slow down your hands. It's too fast. Slow down. Slow down. That's right. That's better. Take your time. Easy. And blow bubbles. Okay. It's all right. It's okay. You are. We're gonna slow down these things. So, is it all right? Yeah. Okay. So there's two things you're doing better. You're slowing down a bit with your hands. Okay, that's better than just before. And I want you to blow your bubbles longer in the water. So basically, okay. you blow your bubbles five seconds. Okay. Then you breathe. And you repeat. One, two, three, four, breathe. You do bubbles. Five seconds, you breathe one time, you repeat. And you go slowly, okay? okay. All right, take your time. Have it. One, two, three, four. Breathe, take your time, take your time. One, two, three, four. Breathe. Yeah, that's right, that's right. One, two, three, four. Breathe. That's very good. One, two, three. Okay. All right, much better. How you feel? Okay, you control these entire things. You control the speed, you control your emotion, you control your, your effort, okay? Don't spend too much energy. Much better, we do one more time. And when you feel I'm not holding you, is everything the same? Basically, if you keep going like this, you will swim on your own. If you start to panic, you will make it like you want to sink. Yeah. If you stay relaxed, you will continue, okay? So it's, it's you. I will be here carrying you. If I feel I can let you go more, I'll let you go more. If I feel you are not comfortable, I grab you again, okay? So okay. I just give you more freedom. And keep the speed extremely slow. Okay. Breathe slowly. Breathe. 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 Easy. How do you feel? Okay, now I want you to understand something. You can float in the water even if you don't move. If you do nothing, yeah. you're not sinking. Okay? Take a big breath in your chest. Yeah. And be flat underwater like a star. Yeah. Look at the bottom and just do your bubble slowly, okay? Yeah. And I will grab you back. We do five seconds without moving. Perfect. Now, hold the hair in your chest. You do the same, you just hold the breath and you don't move, okay? Try to relax more. If you're too tense up, right, you become hard. You sink more. Yeah. If you're more relaxed, you're more flexible, you will float easier. Less tension. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Okay. How you feel? So you see basically what's happening with your body? Yeah, you become like this. Some people are different, right? Uh, 
So you float from your chest because it's full of air, okay. but your legs are, are strong, heavy, uh, and muscles are heavier than the density of fat. Yeah. So because you have strong legs, yeah. you would sink from your legs. Okay. So you become like that. Yeah. When you swim, you still walk, you just need to kick slowly for your legs to go back on the surface. Right, okay. So what you're gonna do is the same. You don't do anything with your hands, you just open like this, yeah. and you slowly move your legs just to don't become like that, but to keep it up slowly. Okay, with still a star or? Yeah, it's like a star. Your legs. Okay, listen, your legs don't open up. Close your legs and just oh, okay. kick slowly, okay? okay? Basically, you do freestyle kicks slowly. Yeah, your hands can be forward or open, as you prefer. This really not, doesn't make much uh, difference. Yes. yes, that's good. You see, you're flat, right? So I want your legs to do this without being tired, non-stop. Okay. That will make sure your body stay horizontal. Okay. Now what we're gonna do with your hands, instead of doing this, you're gonna start to do walking in the water like we just did before, like a tiger. So you just kick, kick, kick and walk in the water. What I wanna see is you go slowly. I wanna see your speed under control. Okay. No, no stress, no emotion or fear. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay, stop. Listen, what you're doing now the pulling is going up too high <laughs> outside the water. So yeah. what's happening if you don't have good speed? If your hand is too high, your body will so will go down. If your body is underwater, your body float easier. It's like an iceberg, ice cube, you know? If you put the ice cube too high, when you let it go, you will sink. If you keep the ice cube in the water, it will stay at the same level. So basically, I want your body to be in the water yeah. and never outside. So keep your hands in the water. You walk with your whole body underwater. You don't do this outside. You just keep pulling underwater. Okay? Yeah. Yes. That's good. Yes, yeah, stop, stop, stop. Stop, stop. Just, just, just for you to feel. That was good. Yeah. Let's go back. This time your legs, remember? Okay. On the surface. They are sinking a bit. So what's happening? You start like this and then step by step. Choo, 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 yeah. <laughs> so just keep your legs higher. But the pulling with your hands was good. So keep the pulling. All right, that's good. Okay, much better. More flat. Okay, you go faster without being tired. Why? You're flat, so it's easier to glide. Now, your legs are still too deep. Okay. You need to feel in your feet the splash on the surface. Do not have to creak crazy, that's not important. What is important is your legs to be on the surface. So, you are not here, it's too deep, you are here. You feel the little splash, splash, splash once in a while. Okay, one more time. That's it. Keep keep under control your speed and the stress. That was good. Your splash once in a while is okay. Okay, not crazy splash. That was good. But from the beginning, you took a while before it happens. Yeah. So just go immediately up, and then your hands slowly. One, two, three. You can you can walk three times. Then eventually you breathe up with your legs still on the surface. Wait, you forgot about your hands. What you are doing is back to your kind of freestyle. Yeah. Makes you sink more, okay? okay? Just keep your hands in the water so far. Just walk underwater. Your arms never go outside water. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, stop. It's all right. When you breathe, look forward. You have an idea where you go. Okay. Your, your eye gives you an information of the, about the environment, okay? So, when you breathe on the side, that's when you swim freestyle. Yeah. When you don't know how to swim freestyle, it's better than you just look up. So you, you look around where you are, 
you go back under. So basically, you can just by pulling your hands, yeah. lift up your chin. <gasps> Look down, blow bubbles. Okay? So we do the same, but you don't breathe looking left or right. You breathe looking forward slowly. Easy, easy, easy. Easy, easy. When you breathe, easy. You don't breathe like... You take your time. <sighs> You can pull two, three times as long as you need. Go back, blow your bubbles, okay? So we do five second bubbles. Breathe on the surface, five second bubbles. That's good, okay. That's all right, it's okay. That was okay, but you still want to turn on the side. <laughs> Just forward. Breathe, and look down again. That's good. The kick and the pull are good. The breathing, you, you freaked out a bit. Just, just no panic, just easy. It's exactly the same. Just chin up forward, okay? Should I try chin up only without putting my head in water at all? No, 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 no. It's, it's very good to swim head underwater, okay. blowing bubbles. That, you keep that, yeah. but when you breathe, don't turn left or right, just lift up and take your time. Okay, let's go back. Yes, correct. Stop, stop, stop. That was correct. Because it was correct, I want you to understand you can do it. All right, now we do again. And what I do is I'm here. There is no drop between us. Okay, I want you to breathe here, looking at me when you breathe. Blow your bubbles and come and see me, we stop here. Okay, take your time, slowly. It's okay. You grab my hand after, but you go slowly, okay? Go back again, we do again, that was good. The beginning was good, the first bubbles. The brief was good, but after you immediately freak out. I want you to go back underwater and repeat. Breathe. Easy, easy, easy. Okay, look. You did a good breathe, but after you're scared. Breathe. And repeat the bubble slowly. It's a repetition between doing bubble slowly, breathing, and repeat. Doing bubble slowly, repeat. Okay? Don't get scared by breathing more and more. 